Spencer, what are the coins to watch and the coins to stop watching? <laughs> <laughs> well, look, I think when you think about something like JP, Mor JP Morgan's coin, this is an intranet. I think what you want to focus on is internets, so the open networks that anybody can build on top of. Those are things like Bitcoin and Ethereum. I really wouldn't suggest that people go much further down the spectrum than those two. To where? B BTC and ETH. That's All right. it. All right. So it's just two. Uh, you know. Those are the main that I would focus on for most Not people Ripple. right now. Maybe down the line. Is so he's saying stay away from Ripple, which I disagree. I do feel like you should own a little bit of Ripple. I still own a little bit of Litecoin, a little bit of Bitcoin Cash, uh, Bitcoin Trash. So uh, if you're just investing $500 or $1,000, then yes, I think Bitcoin and Ethereum is all you need. But if your crypto portfolio is going to be going over $5,000, I think it would be foolish to only invest in two coins. Now, I would still have maybe 50 if you want to be even conservative, 75% be Ripple, I'm sorry, uh, Bitcoin and uh, Ethereum. But at a certain point, you do want to hold some other coins just for diversification purposes. And I don't recommend putting all your assets into one coin. And if you have been watching this channel, I've been recommending that you should be diversified in multiple assets. So uh, if you're going to own crypto, you should also own precious metals like gold and silver. Uh, I do believe that you should be somewhat invested in the stock market, even though I right now recommend cash uh, just due to the uh, volatility of the market. And uh, my biggest proponent is real estate. And uh, I understand that real estate is something that might be down the line, but you should be hoping to invest in real estate. And when I say invest, that means you would not be living in the property. You'll be renting it and treating it like an in income generating asset. Uh, and I'll have more materials on that on the channel as well. Um, so although we're going to be covering cryptocurrency news, uh, my coverage and my opinion on investing is diversification. So as much as I'm a huge cryptocurrency enthusiast, uh, I'm actually primarily invested in real estate. And then uh, I do have other holdings of stocks, bonds, and cryptocurrencies just to balance out my portfolio where I'm not invested into just one asset class. But let me know your thoughts on this and I will talk to you guys soon.